Good morning, everyone. So our virtual assignment today is going to be a little different than the last few we've done. We are going to start a pretty much a recycling project. So if you look here for today, this is day eight. Reduce, reuse, recycle, restore purpose. We are going to um, basically you're going to find something, some trash, some junk, something around the house, and repurpose it into something else. For instance, a lot of people are pulling items out of their uh, recycling bin and turning it into something else. A basic example would be taking a, you could take a milk carton or a milk jug, turn it into a, a planter for a garden or a potted plant inside the house. So if we look in today's instructions, it says open or download prevent print the um, activity page. I'm going to show you that in a second. Spend some time looking for materials and ideas for your project. Complete the milestone one assessment. And when the project is finished, complete the project reflection and discussion. That'll be next week's assignment. So today we just want to focus on first three things here. So if we go back, we see COVID RRRRRR activity, which we click on there. So the terms, oh, so this is the project we're doing. So repurposing use of use of products and materials for purposes other than originally intended, recycle and convert waste into reusable materials. So we're going to be do, focusing on one of these two things for our project. So you want to complete one or more of the following, develop a new use for a product or material, restore, fix an old broken item, Create something useful items that are normally looked at as worn out or trash. Um, so rules, you're allowed to copy and improve upon the ideas of others. So I encourage you all to go online on YouTube, find projects people have done, replicate it, make it even better, make it different. Um, should take at least a minimum 40 minutes to complete. So to do the whole project, you want to complete it in your virtual learning time on this Wednesday and next Wednesday. So that's the only time you have to spend towards doing it. Should take at least 40 minutes, might take you less than that. But that's how this is going to work. Uh, use whatever materials they have at home to complete this assignment. Please keep in mind that the main goal of this assignment is to reduce, reuse, or recycle. M project must not be dangerous, legal, or violate any of our school policies. Uh, well, the two weeks thing, we're sort of doing that, but we're doing this in two days. So if you want to Google or search for some ideas, these things here, if you um, search for these, you'll find all kinds of projects you can work on. And any materials you use, anything is safe, non-toxic. Um, if you do use any tools, make sure you have a parent with you or a guardian. And I already talked about that. So this is going to be worth, um, I think, 30 points for each day. So it'll be worth about any other um, project we do in class. So we go back to the folder. Um, in the milestone one assessment, you have to complete. So it asks you four questions. One, I've read the assignment, yes or no. Um, I search for ideas on the internet by, or by using other sources. There's five points. So what projects are you thinking about working on and what materials are you planning to use for this project? So that's all you have to answer tomorrow. So basically you want to look around your house, find the materials you want to use, and you can start the project. And then you just want to finish it by next Wednesday. Now, just as an example, so here are some things that students a couple months ago made. So this person took a juice jug, turned it into a bird feeder. Um, this person made a rubber band gun out of I'm not entirely sure what that is. Let's see. I don't know what this person made. Oh, they turned that into a potted plant. Okay. What's going on here? Ah, someone took a old can and made it into a decoration or a supplies holder. Ah, it looks like they took cardboard, made it into something to hold jewelry and keys and stuff. That's pretty neat. I uh, don't know what that is. Not sure what's going on there either. Okay, someone took this out of the wood shop, found an old um, piece of scrap wood, and I'm not sure if that's painting or they might have used the laser cutter to engrave um, the sides on it, but she made a die. So these are some examples. You can do whatever you want. There's all kinds of options. So tomorrow, you want to do this part of the assignment. We're going to, you're going to think about your project, find some materials, gather them up, and start working on it. Doesn't be too complicated, and it'll be due next Wednesday. So you have when next Wednesday as well to work on it and submit a picture of it. If you have any questions um, or you want to do a, a a Zoom meeting, just send me an email. I'm usually pretty good at getting back to you, and, and I will see everybody on your next class, which will either be Thursday or Friday. Have a good day.